So what we have here is we have log base 4 of 2 plus log base 4 of 32. So to solve this type of problem, what we're going to have to do is um, we're going to have to see, see if we can evaluate the log of. But you know, the problem says not to use a calculator. So it's fun, right? Um, so 4 raised to what number is going to give me 2? Well, that's kind of a tough one because 4 raised to the first power gives me 4. Um, 4 to the 1 half power, though, would give me 2. So I can actually do, uh, you know, 4 to the 1 half power would work. And, however, we're going to get a little bit trickier here. So here, so this would be 1 half. Good, I got that. But then log base 4 is 32. So 4 to square is 16. 4 cubed, though, is 64. So there's not going to be an even number that's going to give me 32, right? Well, so I guess I could probably maybe see if I can think about it really hard in my head. But otherwise, I see I have an addition problem. Well, I know I can use my properties logarithm to condense it down to one logarithm using multiplication. So let's try that and see if that helps us out at all. Log base 2 of 4 times 2 times 32. And this is going to help us because now I can do 2 times 32, which is 64. And as I previously stated, I guess I won't use my parentheses. But log base 4 of 64 now represents 4 raised to what number gives me 64? Well, we know that answer is going to be 3. Yes. So when condensing these logarithms to evaluate, we know that our answer, by using these properties, will give us 3. And I didn't use my calculator.